Hey guys, it's Crypto Marie. She does it all. A little bit of everything. I am going to give you the latest on Marie's crypto news now. I am hoping everybody's doing amazing. Right now, the crypto market is not looking bad at all. Everything is green and up to go, and I am loving it. Okay, let's see what's going on. Um, sheep price analysis for February 7th. Now, remember, I'm telling you the title. If you want to know more about it, you go to You Today or Coin Telegraph or your Yahoo news google and find out what it is about okay uh repo alley versus sec here is latest update after when on secondary market sales xrp's most surprising prediction made by reaper financial ceo detail is ahead that was from yesterday yeah if y'all want to know you go and find out what is it about Gone boy, search for crypto fugitive. Ducron hits up and Serbia, S E R B I A, Serbia. You know what, guys? I saw one TikTok gentleman, one guy was in there, and he said that he promised himself that he would not be checking his crypto account for six months. So he went on vacation, I guess, from where he was. He did not hear or have any clue idea that terra luna had crashed down so before he went on vacation his account had a balance of two million dollar when he came back it feels like he was in a dream i feel so bad for the guy he was crying sobbing like a baby saying oh my goodness he believed in terra luna he invested everything he had in it before he went on vacation. His balance said $2 million. And because he said he was not going to check it for six months, when he came back checking it, it was nothing. Guys, to tell you the truth, not only I let it play over and over to take notes so I can let you guys know the real truth behind losing it all man it can really knock you down a grown man crying sobbing oh my god it was painful to watch and what i took from that man if you can take profit take profit not financial advice don't leave nothing for tomorrow don't leave anything for the next day whatever man at this point i'm thinking I know I lost a hundred thousand in twenty twenty one, but to lose two million dollar, and to tell you the truth, I check my account so often. I think I'm addicted to this thing, y'all. I check this sucker like nobody's business. Every five seconds, <laughs> every minute, I am checking it consistently because I need to know: Are we up? Are we down? What's going on? How's the market is doing? Because if there is some kind of activities, things going up, I need to take some profit. I need to take some money. I'm not going to be betting on not checking for six months for a year to see how, how much you can hold. No, man. Probably if he had checked it during the crash, he could have saved some money. The man lost it all and he's sobbing. There was something about seeing a grown man crying that touches me so deeply like you know usually they expect men to be strong macho man take it all don't worry we got this mm, mm, mm. but to see him see everything he had goes down to the drain and there was no comeback for this man this is not a joke and since he was out i don't know where he was for six months he actually had no clue his two million dollar was gone yeah this is not a joke Whew. Okay, let's go back to business. Cardano DJ had stable coin record 14,500%. Ooh, growth and unique addresses. Okay. Shiba Inu and Cardano show something you don't want to miss. That was yesterday. It was a mistake to trust Craig Wright, Bitcoin Foundation, Gavin Anderson. I don't know what they're talking about. If you want to know, you just go ahead and Google and see what's going on. Ripple CTO 
congratulates Elon Musk on beating SEC. Poor Ripple lawyer shares plans if Ripple wins bond record no listing crypto no digest you today that's stuff that they're supposed to be doing later on avalanche expands horizons with new decentralized exchange i'm doing my best yeah my eyes i need to have a check out or something it's not the same even though i sleep enough i'm taking some vitamins i'm still feeling tired exhausted i really don't know what's going on yeah um Repo shifts close to 400 million XRP. Here's what's happening. Ethereum burns riches level that might start affecting price. Oh, really? Shiv and ADA Cardano show something you don't want to miss. Ripple Financial CEO makes surprising XRP prediction. Ancient Doge addresses wake up. Yeah, I heard something about that. Like somebody had put some away. Don't touch it for a long time. Now nah, they start touching. I don't know why. And they call it ancient. Like it's been around for a hundred years. Give me a break. Bitcoin just printed its first golden cross in months. What's next? I don't know. Matic up 12%. Bloomberg's senior strategist explains why Polygon is superior. Charles Hawkinson might be guest on Joe Rogan's podcast, 270 billion sheep move by bankrupt broker LBRY advocates for Coinbase releasing XRP. Where is the Shiba Inu sheep going with its 20% price spike? Three main targets. Weepo City or hence a a Satoshi Nakamoto's identity, Doge Army stunned by McDonald's refusal to go viral. <laughs> she burn rate drops hard. Listen, not every good offer is actually good. McDonald's is a big brain, you know, from all over. There's some outside the United States, they have some places they sell McDonald's. So before they say yes to take Dogecoin, they have to look at is it gonna be in the advantage in America or in other countries? What are the risks of accepting Elon, uh, uh, Dogecoin? You know, they can't just say yes because the richest person give them an offer they cannot refuse. They have to look at it. Give them some time to do a little research. Uh, they own due diligence in crypto to see. Okay. What are the good, bad, ugly? If we decide to do this, can we handle the situation? Is it gonna be good? Is it gonna be in our, in our advantage? You gotta give them some time to think about it, okay? And uh, let's see, it's a lot of stuff from a week ago. I don't wanna do this. I want something that just happened hours. Arthur Hayes started buying Bitcoin. Here's why, okay. This is crazy. This is what I'm talking about, okay. I know somebody say, you know, you could DCA on buying Bitcoin. Listen, I have other coins, mean coins that I'm focusing on. I'm not going to try to buy $500 Bitcoin today, tomorrow, another 200 and then never really get to a full Bitcoin. I don't have time for that. I don't have time to race. Good for you. You could DCA on it. Not for me. So again, when Bitcoin was at $15,000, $16,000, people with money did not grab as many as they could. Right now, it's at 23, going to be 24, soon 25, and then 30. That's when people are going to go crazy. FOMO, fear of missing out on buying. Why didn't you buy when we had the Ford? Everything was down on the floor. It just doesn't make any sense. I don't know when people are going to get this. Buy when it's cheap. Buy when it's on sale. It's like you wanted a Rolex. They are very expensive watches. You wanted it so bad, you could not wait to get it. There is a sale. You will buy it for half of the price. Come on. You will run to get it. But no, that's not what people do. They wait till they get to some of them 50000 a 100000 200 something plus. I don't know. I don't buy stuff like that. I don't care for stuff like that. But $124,000, $125,000 Rolex, 
if you get it at half price, wouldn't you go for half price and the other half you will, you know, invest it or do something else with it? Why would you go full price when you can get it for half price? Let me give you a simpler example. You want a McDonald's meal for eight dollar. I don't even think they have stuff like that anymore. Everything's so expensive now. It's on sale on Wednesday for four dollar. Wouldn't you go get your best meal for four dollar instead of paying eight dollar for it? It's the same for the crypto market. That's one thing I give Andrew take credit for. I saw one of his TikTok videos say it's the same effing coin that you used to pay twenty something thousand dollar for, and now it's on sale. Why don't you buy it now? The only thing about he said a lot of stuff that is true is this is his arrogance. His way of saying things that kind of brush me off. But when he said that, I said, I agree with you, man. People would not buy the things when it's on sale, but they will buy it when it's expensive, when it's at its highest. And then when it's drop on in the price, you cry and say, oh, my God, oh, this thing is no good. Oh, I paid so much money for it and now it worth nothing. Well, hello, why didn't you buy it when it was half price? I'm done with this conversation. I'm so sorry. It just, it just, sometimes it just, you get tired of saying the same thing over and over and people still going to do what they feel like doing and you cannot stop it. It is what it is. All right, let's go back on track. Millions of Solana tokens shifted in recent hours. What's happening? 400 million Cardano ADA tokens staked since early December. Um... SHIB Trifecta accepted via prepaid Visa cards. Michael Berry shocks community with one word tweet. Elon Musk tweet slaps Doge Army. Crypto News Digest you today. That's about five days ago, yeah. Jasmine up 14% after AI would mop unveil. I like the name itself, Jasmine. Jasmine, that's beautiful for a girl. Ex Coinbase product manager pleads guilty to insider trading. Really? Ooh, that's that's some juicy stuff here. <laughs> Elon Musk joined AI hyped as these tokens price go vertical. Cardano holding strategy shared by crypto influencer Locked Davis. Cardano's Ethereum sidechain goes live in public testnet. Let me tell you guys something. AI is going to go crazy. Alameda Research address flag moving new funds. What's happening? Uh oh. No, seriously, guys. Um, AI tokens gonna go banana, ballistic, to the moon soon. But what I'm trying to see, I'm going to try to wait a little bit to see if it could. I know it's going to cool off. It's going to cool off. The minute it goes down a little, I'm going to move in like a snake <laughs> and grab as many as I can. Yeah, because this thing is going crazy. If Elon Musk putting his finger on it, you know, it's gold. Elon Musk is the male version of Oprah Winfrey. Whatever they touch turn to gold. Whatever they say turn to blessing. So, I'm going to put some good coin and um, AI tokens. But not all of them are on crypto.com. I have the list of the eight that they have there that you can purchase from there. But, um, yeah, not all of them. Let me see if I could find anything on Cointelegraph. And I want to give credit to Cointelegraph and you today for giving me information to bring to my viewers and my subscribers and I want to say keep up with the good job. I did the best I can every day to report to them. And they respond very nicely on it. So keep it up. Give me stuff to talk about. I will be bringing the information to the public. All right. Thank you so much. All right. Anything? I don't even know who's Arthur Hayes. Arthur Hayes started buying Bitcoin. Here's why. 
one thing I realized after listening to what Michael Saylor said about Bitcoin that he should have put everything into Ethereum. He's waiting for a break even. <laughs> I love that word, break even. So he can rotate everything to Ethereum. Guys, I don't believe anything these people are saying, whether it's positive or negative. I think they are saying it for a reason to attract crowd or something. Because deeply behind the scene, they are dying. They are going crazy. They are going banana. So why should I listen to you when you don't even believe in something that you put so much effort, time, and money into, man? It's just ridiculous. Again, I think this is it for today. And Maurice Crypto News, I see I'm having a lot of people watching more and more every day. I'm so thankful. Leave a comment. And uh, let's get it to 1,000 subscribers. And before you know it, 5,000, 10,000. 57% of the people watch do not subscribe. Come on, let's do it. Subscribe so you can get that information every day. I'm trying my best. Right now, I can't even open my eyes. That's how tired, exhausted I am. But I said, you know what? I have a job to do. Bring you the latest on how the crypto market is doing. So I have to do the best I can to report it to you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. And tell somebody you know to subscribe. May God bless you and have a wonderful one. Bye.